Two teams looking stark for a win. And we are set to go. The Flyers are going to start with the puck after taking the opening draw. Good heads up defensive play as he extends the stick. Pushes it across to Marner. Pokes it away in his own end. Philadelphia's got the puck along the wall. Puts it on net and the save. And the puck stopper hangs on to get a breather here for the team. Lots of time left in this period. We're still scoreless. Matthews wins the draw on their own end. Great defensive effort with the stick. Toronto's got it from behind the net. And that's just out of reach. Blocked by Samsonov. Well, these are the saves when you know that your goaltender is dialed in, James. The ability to get to the top of the crease and be square to the shooter, that's a great save. Toronto's got it in the defensive zone. Penalty coming up. Quick whistle stops the play. Oh, that's a tough way to start a game. I get it. The adrenaline's flowing, and sometimes you're just a little too over-aggressive. Power play unit comes out for the face-off. Well, James, an opportunity to see the league's top-ranked power play their first one of the game to get the go-ahead goal. And what a line this is. They can move the puck, the ability to find open lanes, and man, can they shoot. Gets it out of his own end. Moves the puck. Right up the gut into the attacking zone. Back to the blue line. A brilliant save, read it perfectly. And they'll cover it up, forcing a stoppage in play. Lawton's ready for the draws. They will continue to try to kill off this penalty. Toronto's got the puck inside the offensive zone. And that shot goes nowhere as the lane was filled. Philadelphia's penalty killers get a hold of it. Long reach breaks up the momentum. The Leafs move the puck in the defensive zone. Toronto's got it now. And we'll get a reset after the puck goes up and out of play. Chance to reset here on the draw on this man advantage. Philadelphia's won the faceoff deep in their own end. Trying to get it out. And that's one way to help kill off this penalty as they get the puck out, Cheryl. Well, and you're on the PK unit. You have to be able to anticipate. They do just that. They're able to retrieve the puck and fire it down the ice. Makes no mistake on the clear, James. Hard and heavy on the stick. Grabbed along the board by Domi. Quick pass across to Lilgren. Hammers one. And the stick is best friend on that save right there. Toronto's got control of it now here in the offensive end. And look at this. They turn this offensive end into a pressure cooker. There's a save. And there's a whistle as the goaltender will hang on for a much-needed stoppage. Now lining up here for the face-off after a great shift there, Cheryl. Yeah, in the offensive zone, they have all the momentum. Would be surprised to see a little stall at the face-off here to give their goaltender a little extra breather because he has been under siege, and you can see it on his face. He needs some rest. Matthews can outwit the defense with a nice move, then finish the play with a quick shot. That's his shock and awe zone ability. Konechny's a star who can get his squad buzzing offensively. Before I send it back upstairs, you should know I'll be looking to see who will power their team to victory tonight. Takes a bump but still hangs on to the puck. Toronto's got the puck. The Leafs will play it from the defensive zone. Picking up momentum across the zone here on the right side. And it's kicked away. Frost's penalty is almost expired. 
Philadelphia's got a hold of the puck. And some good footwork to kick it away. And time expires on the power play. Both teams back to even. Well, that's just a great sequence of events with that power play unit. The way they were moving the puck, the execution with their passes and the scoring chances that they did get. Hey, sometimes it doesn't go in, but if they continue that, you got to figure their numbers are going to go up. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. Still looking for our first goal. The Flyers will go to work here in the offensive zone. Made the stop on the play. Every coach is going to tell you, get in front of the goaltender and take away their eyes. It was the goaltender's job to find the puck. He finds it and makes the save. Stones him on the play. Ref blows the whistle as the puck's covered up. Corrado's won the draw. Now let's see what they can do with it. Denies the shooter on that play. The Leafs gain possession. And that's denied. Oh, denied on the play. Wow! Oh, the two competitors save just scores. Mitch Marner. Anytime you're in the grade A scoring chances and you're funneled tight to the net, you want to make sure you get a quick release shot off. There's coverage there. It's all about accuracy at that point, and he doesn't miss. Toronto's got the game's first goal here in the first, and perfect road approach, right? Silence the crowd, Cheryl. Well, yeah, and you got to start with some energy, and you got to get your lines into the game right away, and that's exactly what they did. They're like a wave of momentum, and they capitalize on their opportunity. Here's a chance! Great save from in tight. This is a really nice save, James. I mean, the shooter's in the middle of the ice. He's in the slot area. And he's got to get to the top of the crease, square to the puck to be able to make that save. Great job. And that's blocked. The Flyers have it now. Into the offensive zone. Takes a shot. Oh, and it stays out. He got a piece of that one. Takes a hit. He goes down to the ice and tops up the puck. Comes up with the glove save! That's a fantastic save by the goaltender, but his team has to do a better job of protecting the middle of the ice. Those high-danger scoring chances eventually go in. We're still in the early stages of this period. The Leafs lead it 1-0. Puck is dropped, and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Moves it to Tavares. He carries the puck up along the wing. Shot! Here's a shot! And he catches that one with the glove. The Leafs win that offensive zone faceoff. The Flyers have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. The Caves got it in the defensive zone. Slides the puck over. Dumps it into the O-zone. The Flyers gain possession along the wall. Takes the feed from off the boards. Passes over to Nylander. The Leafs carry it along the wall. The Flyers gain control of the puck. Philadelphia's got the puck in the defensive end. Here's a short pass to Lawton. On the attack into the offensive end, right up the gut. Denies him with the pad. There's the whistle as the puck stopper elects to hang on. The Flyers win the draw. Can't maintain possession. Score! continue to attack. Getting closer to the halfway point of this frame. We got a tie game. Okay. 
Shomi's won the draw. And that's poked away by Drysdale. The Flyers will play it in their own end. Streaking into the attacking zone from the right. Drives to the paint. Oh, a clutch save. Well, this save was way more difficult than it looked, James. I mean, there's so much traffic in front that he's fighting through to see, and he finds the puck to make the save. Both teams gliding into position, and the official set to drop the puck. Palings won the draw here in the offensive zone. Taken by Lilgren. Slides it diagonally to Krieger. Here's an odd man rush. Picked up along the boards by Lilgren. Oh my goodness, it's stayed out. What a save. It was all but in James, and that athleticism and the will to get to that puck, that was on display. As we look at that last save again, James, it is absolutely incredible and so impressive to see a goaltender just out-battle and out-will his opponent to find the puck. The Flyers get a hold of the puck in their own end. And he takes the feed. Toronto's got control of it now from their own end. The Leafs take it along the wall. Can't keep a hold of it after that hit. The Flyers take possession in the defensive end. Toronto's got a hold of the puck now. Takes the feed at center and moves up ahead. Handles the pass. Great reflex on display tonight on his part. Nice zone entry from the right side. And now it's grabbed by Atkinson. Wrist shot from the slot. Big time stop. Samsonov's made a great quality shot look easy. I mean, he is so efficient. He's dialed in, he tracks, and he makes the save. And he takes the dish. Toronto's across the blue line. Here's a chance to the middle. Still lots of time left here in this frame. We are all tied up in this one. Back underway, and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. And he lowers the boom there. Dumps it in. Philadelphia's got a hold of it along the wall. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. Quick shot! Oh, what a great save by Samsonov! We know the goaltender was set to this position, square to the shooter, to be able to make that glove save. And the centers glide towards the dot here as we got a face-off set to go. The Leafs win it in the defensive zone. The Flyers scoop it up along the boards. Knocked off the puck. We got a whistle as the puck's frozen. Here's the change. Lawton's got the puck and they'll go on the attack. And a strong effort on that play. The Leafs have it against the wall. Philadelphia's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Comes up with the stop. Puck battle along the boards. Toronto's got a hold of it against the wall. Gets a piece of it to make the save. Huge steal in his own end. Gets the puck in deep. The Leafs have it now. And that's knocked away by Delorier. Benoit scooped up the puck now here inside his own zone. Textbook poke check by York. Philadelphia's gained possession along the boards. Ristolainen's lugging the puck. And now he passes up to Hathaway. 
And that's a great heads up play in the offensive zone. The Leafs move to the offensive zone. Here he is, shot right in front. Big save. There's the whistle. We'll get a face off after the goalie covers up. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. It's all tied up. Nice job tying up his opponent. Carries it into the offensive end up the middle. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. Quick pass to Tavares. Takes the feed at center and moves forward. Fires it. Oh, and just gets a piece of it. Back to the point it goes. And that goes off a player in front. Tavares is hauled down. The official's arm is up. Let's see the call here. Well, the official is right there to make the call, and no question about it, it's tripping. Anytime you take someone's feet out from under them, you're going to head to the box for two. Toronto's got another opportunity here on the man advantage. When the power play is struggling, you got to get a screen in front, and it has to be with good timing and recognize when that shot is coming. More time off the clock as they grab the puck. And a successful clearing attempt. Takes the feed in the middle of the neutral zone. And that's broken up. I don't think anybody was hanging onto the puck after that hit. Takes it from the other side of the blue line. Nothing. Sometimes players get into those scoring areas and they try and get a little too cute and that's a result right there, not hitting the net. And skilled use of the stick to poke the puck away. Scooped up along the wall by Palin. And he turned that one aside. Receives the pass. Bertuzzi got it along the wing. The Flyers get a hold of the puck under man. Nice job to escape the zone. Moves it quickly over to Bertuzzi. Oh, and he just misses. What an opportunity there. Well, just is a big word, James, because when you... Scores! Putting the special in special teams, they take the lead. And often when you're on special teams, James, it can go either way in terms of the momentum. If you don't generate anything, it goes the other way. If you generate something, it's all in your favor. I'll tell you what, that was execution. This is actually a tougher play than it looks, James. You have to have timing and an awareness to be able to get your stick on that rebound and then bury it. Not a lot of time and space available, but he executes perfectly. The Leafs take the lead after that last goal. And Cheryl, what do you wait for here now? Do you, uh, do you anticipate the counter punch or do you look for the continued push attack? Well, you got to continue to push attack. There is way too much runway left in this game, James. You're in the first period. You got to find a way to continue to compete, continue to maintain the momentum and put your opponent on their heels. Sends it into the offensive zone. Philadelphia's got the puck along the wall. The Flyers are in transition. Takes a shot. And he had an answer with that save. Philadelphia's got possession at center. Toronto's got the puck in their own end. Slides the pass over to Reeves. Sends it in deep. Philadelphia's got possession of the puck. Sends it over to Walker. Philadelphia is looking to break out. Down the left wing, across into the offensive end. Toronto's got the puck. And he takes the pass. Poked away in the defensive end. Slides the puck across to Lawton. Fires it into the offensive zone. Toronto's got the puck. Gaining momentum along the wing. It's in the back of the net. He scores! Oh, that's fast. Two quick goals in a minute 20. Cheryl, you stress consistently. Keep your feet moving on the ice, and that pays off. Well, they got the pedal to the metal right now. They're like a freight train.
Toronto's taken a two-goal lead already here in the first period. They look dominant tonight, Cheryl. Yeah, they've been terrific tonight, James, and they've been able to execute. They've thrown a lot of pucks to the net, but they've managed it extremely well. They've opened up their own lanes, and they've got the opportunities. And a good use of the body to knock the puck loose. The Leafs gain possession. And he coughs it up with the pass. The Flyers have been stealing pucks all game, and when you intercept passes and you find ways to get your sticks in lanes, you typically find a way to possess the puck, but they've got to open it up here. This game's awfully tight. Passes the puck over to Couturier. Great poke check on the reach. Quick feed to Robertson. Toronto's got it in their own zone. Face-off coming up as the puck goes up and over the glass. The Leafs have done a great job moving their feet tonight, and they lead here midway through the first. The Flyers take possession after that neutral zone face-off. Konechny's got the puck. Reaches out and uses the stick. Grabs the puck in the defensive zone. Can't hang on to the biscuit after that. Throws it in. Philadelphia's got the puck along the boards. Here they come. Moves it to Konechny. Fires it on net. Here's a shot. And he comes up with the glove save. More than half the frame has been played here. Toronto's got a 3-1 lead. Off the face off, they take the puck. Great poke by Paling. Shot! Big time stop by Samsonov. Toronto's got it in their own zone. Down the left wing, they gain the zone. The Leafs have it from the corner. Takes the shot. Denies him! He got all of it! Get out of there! Picked up along the wall by Cates. Saucer feed. Forster's got the puck in his own zone. Looks to set up at the point now. Sacrifices the body to block that in front. Samsonov's going to hang on to the puck for a whistle. Puck ready to drop here any moment to get things underway again. Toronto's taking possession in their own end. Slick feed. Looking to set up offensively. Stopped by Ayrson. Well, he's extremely dangerous when he has the puck on his stick. He's like a magician, and it's on a string. This time, though, the goaltender shuts him down. The Leafs have had multiple scoring opportunities here in this first and could easily have a much bigger lead. Toronto's won the draw inside the offensive zone. Now let's see what they can do with it. And that caroms off a body in the lane. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. Bertuzzi's into the offensive zone now on the attack. And that's deflected. Denies him! Ristolainen's taking it from his own end. Good defensive effort to poke it away. Sends it in on the attack. Sends the pass over. Atkinson's got it in the defensive end. Here we go, Cheryl. They're going to go. This is the challenge to that big hit. I thought it was clean, but nonetheless, the gloves are being dropped. There's the takedown, and I think that might be kind of a mercy rule there, right, Cheryl? It's a mercy rule as they're exhausted, and you can see them as they're panting. But what it does mean is that the officials can come in and just break it up. Tough to watch fighting, but sometimes when it's a tilt on the road and you're a winner, it creates a ton of momentum. 
They've got the debris all cleared up off the ice, and both teams step in for the face-off. The Flyers win the draw here in their own end. And he takes the feed. Couturier stick handling in his own zone. Feeds it to Konechny. And now they look to make something happen from the neutral zone. The Leafs get a hold of the puck along the boards. Slides it across to Reeves. And that's broken up in the defensive zone by Walker. Tries to feed it over to Benoit. Takes the feed. Gets a piece of it to keep it out. Oh, he's going to get called on that slash. Oh, these home fans have had enough. They're wondering when a call's going the opposite way here, Cheryl. You can hear the frustration right now with that third call in a row, I might add, James. I mean, this is a one-sided game, isn't it? Unbelievable. Marner's got an opportunity to help the power play score here, guys. One way he can do that is by using his zone ability to get them going. Let's see how it goes here. And they win the draw in the offensive zone, and they go to work. Goaltender covers up. We got a stoppage in play. Another face-off looming here on this power play. Gets a hold of the puck. The Leafs take over on possession. Oh, and he's dialed in tonight. What a save on that one. Can't get it to go. From their own end, trying to kickstart this power play. Here's a short pass to Hathaway. Shot! That's gloved by Samsonov. There's the whistle as the puck is frozen up. Lawton's ready for the draw as they continue to be shorthanded here. The Flyers take possession here inside the offensive zone. Retrieves the puck, trying to kickstart this power play. From the right wing, he moves into the middle. Shot! Stopped by the goaltender. In front, and a stoppage on the play as the goaltender covers things up. Domi's at the face-off dot, ready to win this draw on the man advantage. And they win the draw on their own end. Trying to clear. He grabs the puck here at the point. Nice save off the tender's pad. Lawton's gliding in for the face-off as this penalty kill will continue. Puck is dropped and we are back underway. They'll want to clear the zone here while they're trying to kill off this penalty. Trying to clear the zone. And down he goes as the puck goes free. And the traffic neutralizes that threat. In front of the net, and the goaltender covers up for a whistle on the play. Domi's ready for the draw as we get set to resume this power play. The Leafs win the draw. Now let's see what they can do with it. On the backhand! Oh, what a save on the play! Whoa! Oh, that's Grand Larceny, James. I mean, he just stole one away from his opponent. What a save! Here's a clearing attempt from their own end. And they clear the defensive zone. Toronto's got the puck against the boards. Stopped by the goaltender. Such an impressive save. Love looking at this one again, James. You know that this goaltender is dialed in so focused when they're doing everything to get to the puck and keep their opponent at bay. Paling side still shorthanded here as they slide in for the faceoff. Toronto's won the draw and they'll go to work. And that goes off course off a of body. Now into the offensive zone from the right side. Great use of the twig as he pokes that one away. Steps inside. From point blank. Net is knocked off. We'll get a face off here. 
Gregor is looking to win this draw and this man advantage here. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. And turns aside the slapper with ease. And officials right on top of that one calling for a slashing penalty, it looks like. Well, he's going to sit two minutes for the slashing call here as he's hacks and whacks his way to the box. I mean, this is a deserved penalty. Everyone saw it. Puck set to drop. We've got some four-on-four four coming up. Not typically that we see four-on-four four action, although it's a lot of fun. You certainly know they practice it in practice. This is something that they're aware of. They know what they're doing. They want to possess the puck and try and create numerical advantage. Quick pass to Domi. And there's the save. Philadelphia's got some room to do something here on this power play as their penalty expired. Moves it quickly over to Drysdale. Came up with a nice save. The Leafs will kill off a few extra seconds now. Great use of the stick at center by Ristolainen. Quick feed to Tippett. Looking to make something happen at center. Philadelphia's got a hold of it along the wall. On the attack along the boards. Scores! On the man advantage, they put one home. And this is exactly why you spend so much time in practice working on specialty teams. James, you can see that good movement to open up lanes, just disrupt the box there, and they're able to cash it in. Well, hockey is a game of inches. If the pass isn't on the tape, if it's in your feet, all of a sudden you're fumbling for it, and that gives the coverage time to defend you. But this one, it's right on the money, and the goal is a result. The Leafs have created a lot of scoring chances tonight, and they lead it here late in the first. Domi's won the draw at center. Intercepted at center by Couturier. Philadelphia has been working hard all night, James. They've been intercepting pucks at a great stick position, and it's been a defensive clinic. They've got to find ways to get to the other side of the puck and generate some offense. And the goaltender comes up with a piece of it to keep it out of the net. Great positioning by the goaltender to redirect it to the corner, getting it out of danger. Philadelphia's crossed the line and on the attack. Konechny's got it in the corner. Moves the pass in front. And that goes off someone in front. Handles it along the blue line. Here's a shot. Cut into the glove by Samsonov. Here in the later stages of this period, Philadelphia is trailing by one. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. From the right side, takes the pass. Here's a shot, a big stop right there. Officials have got both teams ready and it looks like play is set to resume here. Toronto's got it in the offensive zone. And that goes off someone in front and doesn't reach the net. Puck is frozen and will get a face-off. And off the draw, they win possession. And they continue to fight for that puck along the wall. Walker's moving the puck through his own zone. Steps into the offensive end. Let's see what the officials are calling. A tight game at the end of a period, and you take a penalty. Your key players have to come up huge and get you to the intermission. surprised to see the 1-3-1 one, one again. They had success on it earlier, James. And listen, I love this. I coach this with my team because I love the bumper spot and I love the net front player. You're taking away the eyes of the goaltender, but he can also pop out below the goal line and present as an option. So multiple variations that can strike. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Marner. The Flyers scoop it up along the boards. Good hit to bump him off the puck. Angles it over to Marner. 
right through center and into the offensive zone. Moves it to Giordano. Denies him in front. Well, this is an incredible save, James. It's anticipation as well. Recognize that the shooter is in the low slot, getting in front of it and making the save. Here's a shot. Oh, what a slick stop by Samsonov. Here's a shot. Oh, and there's a great save by Samsonov. Rips it and rips it. And that shot dies in traffic. Philadelphia's got a hold of the puck now. Toronto's got possession while under man. The Leafs looking against the half wall. Some solid defensive work in their own end with the poke check. Couturier scanned the line and on the attack. Can't connect as it goes off a stick. And he denied him there. Moves it over to Matthews. The Flyers look to start the transition game. Here's a short pass to Couturier. Through the neutral zone up along the wing. Grabs control of it at the point. Cuts to the paint. Blocked by the defender. Nice play. Hammers the shot. And he scores! And the power play works to perfection as they tied it up. Well, the power play unit knew what was at stake. They knew that they had an opportunity to get the equalizer in this game, and they executed perfectly. Sometimes when you're down and out in a game, it's all about that next shift. You take it one at a time, you chip away at the lead, and you find yourself at evens. This is a momentum switch here now, James. It's what they can do next to see if they can go ahead. Centers are lined up, and we are ready to resume. Face off here in the neutral zone, and we are back underway. Here we go, pucks in deep. The Flyers move the puck in the defensive zone. Sends a pass over. Couldn't catch up to that pass. Works it across to Nylander. There's the buzzer, 20 minutes in the books. Second period just around the corner. Teams with a chance to recharge and refresh in this second period about set to get underway. Both teams looking for that go-ahead goal here as we get underway in the second, still tied. Well, Cheryl, how do you sum this one up through the first 20 minutes? The Flyers really haven't generated anything offensively, and I believe it starts in their defensive end, James. They're not connected, they're not getting exits that create speed through the neutral zone, and their opponent's doing a good job to shut it down. They have a minority of the shots, but they're lucky it's still tied. They can get back in this game. Wax it into the offensive zone. The Leafs gain control of the puck against the wall. Slides it over with pace to Marner. Steps inside the attacking zone down the left wing. And that's intercepted by Konechny. The Leafs gain possession along the wall. Dishes it to Sanheim. Inside the offensive zone. Quick pass to Konechny. That's blocked by Samsonov. There's the whistle as the goalie hangs on. Lots of time left in this period. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Toronto's got a hold of the puck. Moves it quickly over to Benoit. Puck knocked loose in the neutral zone. Philadelphia's got the puck in the corner. Nothing doing. 
You got to get a shot on that, James. You get in tight, you have an opportunity in that scoring area, and you don't even get a shot on net. Not good enough. Oh, a save on the play! Oh, it's such an athletic save, James. I mean, that's just all about competing, finding a way to get to the puck. Tremendous pressure here in the offensive end. And they'll dump it in. Philadelphia's got a hold of it against the wall. Sends one up to Frost. What a steal in his own end. And now it's over to Nylander. Takes the feed. Gives them nothing in front. Puck is frozen, and we get a stoppage in play. Both teams are set. We'll drop the puck here. Domi's won the draw, and they'll look to set up. The Flyers will play it from the defensive zone. Through center. Shot denies him with the pad. This is a fantastic save, James. He's all over it. What I mean by that is he knows exactly where it is and where it's moving. A reason why he can get square to it and make the save. And they win the offensive zone faceoff, and here we go. Blocked in traffic. And the puck stopper jumps on top of it to get a stoppage in play. Offense is on face off, and he wins the draw. The Leafs gain possession in their own end. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Hangs on to the puck after taking a hit. Poked away by Paling. And loses possession after a solid hit. From the point, they take control of it. Scoops up the puck now. Quick pass to Paling. Poked away at center ice. Philadelphia's got the puck. Slides the puck ahead into the neutral zone. An easy pad save made by Sam Sodov. Goaltender hangs on for the whistle. We're still in the early stages of this period. It's all tied up. And with the two centers tangled up, the winger skates away with it. Sam Sodov's got the puck and he's going to hang on. Centers gliding up to the face-off dots here. The Flyers win it. Quick feed to Ristolainen. Toronto's looking to break out of their own end. Here they come up along the wing. Here we go. Odd man rush here. What a stop. Philadelphia's got a hold of the puck. Couturier's got it across the line. Puts it on there. Makes the glove stop. And we'll get the whistle after the goaltender hangs on. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Takes the pass. And they send it right back to him. Poked away by York. The Flyers have it now. Moves it to Ristolainen. And he loses control here. Good read with the stick to break that up. Great pressure on the offensive end by Matthews. Turn that chance aside. Handles the pass from the right side. Handles the puck. Here's a short pass to Frost. Chance in front! Samsonov's going to hang on for a whistle. <laughs> Off the draw, they take possession. Quick pass across to Reeves. Moves the puck. Here's a shot. Oh, and he 
steps up with the glove to stop that one. Still plenty of time left in this frame. You can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. Frost won it off the faceoff. Philadelphia's got the puck in the defensive end. Here's a chance. Oh, how do you miss that? I mean, it's all part of the game, but Cheryl, you've got to connect on that one. Well, you do, especially when you get those great A scoring chances. You have to find a way to, at minimum, get it to the net. But, man, I think he had a little more time on his side, and it just ricochets off his toe. And the puck's kicked free. Philadelphia's gained possession along the boards. Slides the puck over. Quick feed to Sanheim. The turnover. Here they come. And he connects with the long bomb. Good heads up play in the defensive zone. Oh, what a save of the play. Whoa. He's doing absolutely everything he can to keep his team in this game, James. Unbelievable save. Gets the puck in deep. Philadelphia's got the puck along the boards. And he takes the feed. Oh, what a hit against the boards! Executed perfectly, James. I mean, he can't score! And we take a drive to Clutch City as they take the lead. Well, the lead is in their hands, and now it's about building off of that. Good shift management, dictating pace, controlling the offensive zone. Everything now, it's on the line. He's in a high-danger scoring area. He's got a bit of time, but he knows he's going to have coverage come to him right away. So a quick snapshot, and he buries it. Philadelphia's taken a one-goal lead here in period number two. Yeah, now it's about not sitting back, not saying, hey, we've got a lead, we're going to protect it, but being aggressive and trying to go after more. Handles the pass. Takes a shot. The Leafs gain possession. And he loses both the puck and his balance after that hit. Loses possession after he takes a little hit. Feeds the puck up to Krieger. Steps across the line and on the attack down the right side. Moves it quickly over to Paley. Shot stopped by the goaltender getting a piece of that one. Slides it diagonally to Walker. Puts it on net. Denied by the goaltender. Toronto's moving it into the offensive end. And called for the offside. We'll get a face-off. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. The Flyers are looking to build on this one-goal lead. Couturier's quick stick lands from the puck here at center. Farabee's got it in the offensive zone. And cut that one out of the net. Goaltender covers it up. We get a whistle to slow things down. And we're moments away from getting back underway here with the puck drop. Locks them up on the draw as they take possession. Gains the zone from the right side. We got a whistle. Penalty coming up. They got to put a pin in the penalty balloon here, James. The frustrating calls, no question about it. But they got to figure out a way to control their emotion and get back in this game. Toronto's power play unit puts their hard hats on as they go back to work. Well, they earned this a power play, James, through hard work, and it's an opportunity to even the score here. They need to find a way to execute and get back to the even score. The Flyers will play it in their own end. Good fight for the puck along the boards. Takes a shot, and too much traffic in front blocks that one. Gaining speed through center, and here they come on the attack. Quick shot. Oh, how did he get a glove on that? What a stop by Samsonov. Paling's ready for the draw as they continue to be shorthanded here. And they take possession. Nice job tangling him up on the draw. 
trying to get something going here with this man advantage as they start from their own end. Toronto's got it along the wall. Here he is in close. And they got caught up in traffic and hits a stick. Puck skips into the bench and will get a reset. Hope everyone's enjoying the game here tonight. Another big face-off here on this power play. Tavares wins the offensive zone face-off, and here we go. Puck dumped in. Toronto's got possession of the puck. Right up the gut into the offensive end. Broken up with the stick in the defensive end. Konechny's lugging the puck. And they send it down the ice. The Leafs have it against the wall. And he takes the dish. Pass back to the point. Big stop by the goaltender right in front. Trying to clear the puck. And the puck clears the zone. That's why you want players with active sticks on your PK, James. They can close quickly and they can corral the puck and just fire it down the ice. Moves it to Nylander. And that's knocked away by Sealer. Puck battle along the boards. Receives the pass. Philadelphia is looking to break out. The Flyers will try to shave a few seconds off this penalty now. Atkinson's been whacked on the play. The official's arm is up in the air. Big hit, and that frees up possession. Here comes the call. When you're down a goal, you can't generate any offense if you're shorthanded. They're going to have to be opportunistic, find a way to kill it off, and then reset the momentum. As we get set for the face-off, a chance to see both teams in a little four-on-four -four action here. Well, four-on-four -four is similar to three-on-three. -three. There's more ice available, and you can't just dump it in. You want to possess the puck and try and create numbers around the ice. That two-on-one's all over. Made that stop. I love his confidence and composure with the puck, James. I mean, he will manipulate his opponent as he's maneuvering his way to the net because he's willing to pause. He's got that confidence. But when he gets net front, man, the goaltender is in a ready position and makes a nice save. Philadelphia is going on the attack as they gain the zone. Here's a great use of the stick right there to poke it away. Toronto's got it in their own zone. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. The Flyers get a hold of the puck in their own end. Gains the zone along the right wall. Oh, excellent use of the stick as he knocks that one away. And the puck is moved to a safer spot on the ice. Fires it! Shuts him down! Taken along the wall by Drysdale. Gaining momentum up along the side. Takes a shot and makes the save. We'll get a face-off after the puck stays covered up. Couturier's ready for the draw on this man advantage. The Leafs win it in the defensive zone. That knocks him off the puck. Tries to feed it over to Atkinson. And the traffic jam in front blocks the shot. Nice play, shorthanded as they get control of the puck. Good clearing attempt to breathe. Grabbed along the board by Couturier. Through the middle of the ice, they enter the attacking zone. Marner's taking it from his own end. Toronto's ready to go on the attack. Fires it into the offensive zone. Angles it over to Konechny. Carries the puck through the neutral zone. Great reach with the post check. Here's a short pass to Couturier. And that goes off a stick somewhere in traffic. A chance to get it out. And they get it done. Dishes it to Atkinson. Gains the zone through center. Tavares is now standing ready to get back on the ice. Both sides back to even strength. Well, everyone is up. The coach knows exactly what the PK unit had to do. And they got out there. They were responsible. And they took care of business. Takes the feed at the point. There's the whistle. Let's see what the referee saw. 
And yet another penalty is called, so out comes the PK unit. And you know what? They are taxed. They are worn down. If this continues, it's all going to backfire. Philadelphia has got another opportunity here on the man advantage. Well, they've worked on this setup in practice on the power play. It's already worked for them this evening, James. You can certainly see the confidence that they have in this particular setup. And man, has it been effective. Puck slid down the ice. Quick pass to Frost. Grabs the puck and moves on out here with this man advantage. Great read with the stick. They clear the zone. The Flyers have it now. Philadelphia's got it in their own zone. Oh, the ref didn't like that whack. Here's the official call. This is not the way they wanted the game to go. Just undisciplined, taking a ton of penalties. They'll have to reset and refocus if they want to find a way to get on top. Philadelphia's got a five on three and the clock's their BFF here. What an opportunity, a long five on three here, and this can turn the momentum, switch the... Oh, well, there's gonna be a call on that one, James. Benoit's got the puck in his own zone. Picking up some steam at center ice. And uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. Let's get the call. Well, the refs are calling a really tight game, and man, this has been a parade to the penalty box, and the entire bench looks agitated, and as a result, they keep taking more. Face off and another opportunity to take a look at the man advantage unit here. Sometimes you're trying so hard, you do take a penalty, and that's a tough one to take, but they still have a huge opportunity here and a very threatening four on three. Tries to get this man advantage going from their own end now. Faraby's crossed the line and gained the zone. Too many bodies in the way. Benoit's got it in the defensive end. Oh, nice use of the boards with the paint pass. Philadelphia's got the puck along the wall. And he's tripped up on the play. Referee's hand goes up here. And the play is whistled dead. Here's the call. Tough spot to be in. You need momentum, and you give it back by going on the PK when you're trailing by one. A daunting task looms for the penalty-killing unit here on this four-on-three man advantage. Sometimes when you have more time on a four-on-three, you get into a low mode and you don't attack the net. Yes, you can be more patient, but you have to create motion and open up those lanes. The Flyers scoop it up along the boards. Great pass off the boards. And he takes the pass. Turned aside with the glove by Sam Sodoff. And the goalie covers up for the whistle. Domi's recognizing they're still shorthanded here as they get ready for the faceoff. And with the centers tied up, he swoops in to take possession. And the puck leaves the offensive zone. They'll be forced to tag up. Directs it on over to Tippett. At center ice now. He grabs the puck. Scores! And there's another power play goal. Well, practice makes perfect, and you know that they've been working on this in practice. They've got the right personnel, the coaching staff has showed them video of how they want it executed, and they deliver tonight. Goaltender spent so much time tracking pucks, anticipating plays, and knowing exactly where they are in the net, and he thought he had this covered, but unfortunately, he was beat just inside the post. Philadelphia is now up by two here in the second. They've really pushed the pace this entire game, James. It's going to be a question as to whether they can really close it out. And their first few strides have been urgent. That tells me they've been prepared right from puck drop. And they've got the puck after that neutral zone faceoff. Shot! Oh, what a great save by Samsonov! Drives to the sweet spot! And it's in the net! That's a goal! They're going to count that one! He's got to be sick 
to his stomach, James. That's such a deflating goal. He thought he had as he's looking for it. He just pushes it into the net. That's frustrating. The Flyers are having a laugh tonight up by a bunch now. Well, when it's working for you, it's working for you. And you know that the coach loves this as well because guess what? The entire bench is going to be utilized. They're all in rhythm. Get them all out there. Puck picked up by Sanheim. And they'll go the other way with a great play by Domi. And they score on the delayed penalty. They make it count. Well, they do make it count, James. Now it will negate their power play opportunity. But hey, when you capitalize, you don't get the power play. Man, James, he's the benefactor of a great passing play. I mean, incredible vision to be able to land that puck right on his stick. But then he's got to do something with it, right? He's got to read where the goaltender is, and he's got to hit the back of the net. Toronto's finally got the counterpunch they need. Now can they do it again, Cheryl? That's the question. Well, they need the knockout punch, don't they? And if they're going to get two and claw their way back in this one, but the momentum's in their favor right now. But it's their choice to do something with it. Moved up ahead here in the neutral zone. Fires it on net. And he'll likely feel that one in the morning. Back at the point, they set it up. And he says no. Drysdale stick handling in his own zone. The Leafs take possession here in the open ice. Tries to get the puck to Domi. Toronto's on the attack. Here's a pass in front. Great defensive heads up play to pick it off. From the point, looks to make something happen. And the play continues. Samsonov's opted to hang on to the puck for a faceoff. Philadelphia's lead here in the second period a direct result of being the more aggressive team offensively and they win the defensive zone faceoff solid check to slow him down and a delayed penalty coming up as he got tripped up here comes the sentence Tippett's called for tripping he's off to the box you want to utilize north south east west and capitalize on the speed with the extra ice available you can bet your coaching staff is going to put some pretty quick players out there looking to make something happen along the boards comes up with the stop quick feed to couturier and that ricochets off a twig in front here they come down the left side on the attack Puck is scooped up here inside the offensive zone by Domi. His reflexes on display tonight. Moves it to the middle, and that's stopped. The Flyers gain control of the puck against the wall. Picked up along the boards by Couturier. Philadelphia is on the attack. Sends it out in front, and that doesn't connect. Stones him in front. The goaltender is very aware of where that puck is in that low slot area and defends his crease by getting out, being aggressive, and taking away any of the net. Goaltender covers up and will get a face off. Tavares is at the face off dot and will try to win the draw as we are about to resume this power play. Puck is dropped and we are back underway. Trying to clear. And the puck is cleared. Well, you can see the entire PK unit. Their heads are on a swivel, straight line skating, and they're able to get that puck. And because they're looking and aware, they're able to find the white ice and get it 200 feet down. And now he passes it to Lawton. And they manage to clear it. Slick feed. Good reach for the stick to knock the puck away. Oh, what a stick save. And they'll get a breather as the goaltender covers it up. Tavares will look to win possession here on the faceoff and try to continue this power play on the right note. Philadelphia's got the win off that draw. Battle along the wall. Scooped up along the wall by Riley. Unloads one. Phenomenal save 
with the glove to knock it away. Puck scooped up by Riley. Oh, what a save in front. Tavares dropped the mitts earlier and spent five minutes in the box for fighting, and he's no good there. He's got to find a way to generate opportunities and get himself back in this game. Tippett's back out onto the ice as we are back to even strength here. And he came up with a solid stop on that play. Here they come through center and into the offensive end. Picked up along the wall by Marner. Gaining momentum in the offensive end. Shot scores! Oh, wow! My goodness, what a finish! When that puck's on his tip, James, you know that he's a magician and he can deke his way to the net like he does just there. But we all know that he's got great hands, James. The way the puck moves on his stick, it's like on a string, but it's also his awareness, the way he scans and how he knows how to manipulate and create space for himself. That's how he gets himself to the net, and then he finishes it off by beating the goaltender. Toronto's got one back. Now can they build on this from here? They need to build on it. This is an emotional goal as the second period is coming to an end, and they have to find a way to continue this momentum and build on top of it as they hit the third. Good defensive stop with the poke check. And we're going to get a face-off after the offside. Toronto's had their opportunities, but they still trail late in this second period. And off the face-off, they take possession. Toronto's got the puck along the wall. Sends the pass over. This is just great puck control to put the puck to the corner. No second shot opportunity. Strong defensive effort. And he makes the save. Goaltender covers it up and we'll get a reset here. Centers glide into the dots. We're ready to get things back going again. Couturier's won the faceoff and now let's see what they can do. And he stopped that one. From the left side, he moves it up ahead. They've got the defense outnumbered. Scores! And the scratching and clawing has paid off as we are back to even. Well, we're back to evens, James. I really like their game. I mean, when you're pushing and you're trying to find a way to get ahead and on top, you have to trust the process. That's exactly what they've done, and they've been rewarded for it. They used their speed on this counterattack and gave themselves an odd man advantage here, James. And what they did was they capitalized. They had multiple looks. They could pass it. They could shoot it. Goaltender couldn't figure it out. And it winds up in the back of the net. The Leafs have set this up to be a dramatic one tonight. They put themselves in a good position here at the end of the second period. It, isn't, it ain't easy to get goals in this game, but they got the equalizer. And it's a nice step heading into the third period. Taken by Sealer. Moves around along the half wall. In close! Denies him in close. A timely save is everything to your team. And this goaltender, he bails his team out. They win the draw and go on the attack. Shot! Stopped by the goaltender. Taken along the wall by Reeves. Moves along the boards with some purpose. And that's off a stick. And that one stopped. And we get a whistle as the goaltender decides to hang on to this one. Toronto's won the draw and they'll go to work. And the lane's clogged up, blocking that. Sealer's got it in the defensive zone. And he takes the feed. Takes a spill onto the ice and loses the puck. And a little physicality ends that threat. And they'll keep on playing as icing is way gone. Scores! There it is, the go-ahead goal! And how good does that feel? You can see the selling. The energy is certainly there, and now it's about dictating the pace going forward. Next shift, critically important. 
Just a fabulous goal, Jane, with a lot of elements woven into it. I mean, he's stumbling, so he almost falls, but he's able to get a shot off just in time. He's able to hold himself up and get that shot off. His hands away from his body, not in the greatest position, but he manages to find the back of the net. The Leafs are in the driver's seat now with that one goal lead and timing, Cheryl, late here in this period. That's huge. That's a huge booster for them, James, not only in terms of their confidence, but also the recognition of where they are heading into the intermission. Now it's about staying aggressive, but managing the puck. They need good blue line decisions. Sends it deep inside the offensive zone. Philadelphia's got a hold of the puck. From the left side, they enter the offensive zone. Broken up by Livgren. Giordano's taking the puck behind his net. The Leafs will play it from the defensive zone. Dumps it in. Philadelphia's got a hold of the puck now. Working the puck deep inside their own end. And now he tries to get it across to tip it. To his teammate! Here's a shot with the stop. Oh, he'd like to have that one back as it goes off the side. Toronto's got a hold of it along the wall. Still has possession. Robertson's got it in the offensive end. Oh, love the defensive stick work there to poke that one away. Here's a shot. And there's a club save on the play. The Leafs continue to put lots of pucks on net here, and they lead it late in the second. Play resumes as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Oh, a clutch save! Works it across to Forster. Nice zone entry from the middle. Philadelphia's got the puck against the half wall. Scores! And we are back to even! Yeah, tie game now, James. I really like the energy that they showed throughout the game, but now it's about channeling the energy they just created and doing something with it. Batters up, eh, James? I mean, you look at that puck as it elevates. I just love the way that he's got his eyes on it the whole time. He makes contact, and he puts it in the net. Philadelphia's equalizer comes on a lot of hard work here in period number two. The coach will be happy with this performance, the pushback, the fight to claw their way back in late in the second, and this will set them up nicely for the third. Puck is dropped, and we are back underway. Paling's got it against the boards. Here's a feed in front, and he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Passes it to Brody. Moves it quickly over to Riley. The Leafs cross the line and gain the zone. Here's a shot. Oh, denied on the play. Wow. That's a true competitor's save. Just when you think that he's completely out of it, James, he comes across with a desperation save to keep his team alive. And as play continues, listen to these fans. They're starting to get loud and recognizing what we saw not long ago here, Cheryl. Yeah, James, I mean, they're continuing to acknowledge the save he made earlier because they know the temperature of this game. And, hey, the fans are now in it. They're all on board, and guess what? The goaltender knows it. And the goaltender grabs that one for a whistle to try to slow things down here. Officials getting ready to drop the puck to get play back underway. The Leafs win the faceoff. Let's the wrister go. Oh, denies him with the paddle save. Every coach is going to tell you, get in front of the goaltender and take away their eyes. Oh, he's so good. Oh, my goodness, what a stop. Oh, that's unbelievable, James. I have no idea how he got to that puck. It's some gymnastics at its finest. And the middle frame almost done. Turn that one aside. Toronto's got it against the boards. And now it's grabbed by Marner. Oh, and he just puts it wide of the net. Konechny's moving the puck through his own zone. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. Pushes it across to McCabe. Great defensive play to come up with the puck. Toronto's got one last chance to make something happen before the end of the period. 
The Flyers get a hold of the puck along the boards. And he can't hang on after that hit. Great reach by Atkinson. Oh, and somehow he gets a sliver of it and keeps him at bay. That's a fantastic save by the goaltender, but his team has to do a better job of protecting the middle of... Oh, at the buzzer, a big save! And he hangs on just as time runs out. And there's the buzzer bringing the second period to an end. You don't want to go home yet, do you? Third period action still to come.
time just moments away as the official signals both teams into position. It has been a fantastic match up here, back and forth the both ends of the ice. Let's see what happens in the third. Play whistle dead, penalty coming up. Well, we know the time on ice numbers are all going to the penalty killers here, James, because it has been an onset, a parade to the penalty box. they got to find a way to play even strength. The Leafs once again send out their power play unit. Power play has scored today, but hasn't been excellent. This is where coaches make adjustments, whether you go with PP1 or PP2, or even if you intermix them. Here's a shot. Fantastic save. Through center along the wing. Shot. Denies him with the pad. There's the whistle as the puck stopper elects to hang on. Paling side still shorthanded here as they slide in for the faceoff. Toronto's got it in the defensive zone. And here's the pass to Marner. Toronto's in on the offensive attack now. Moves it to Nylander. Too much congestion blocks the shot. Answered the call on that play. Love the way the goaltender gets tight to the shooter here. The puck's in the low slot. You want to take away time, you want to take space. Goaltender does it, makes the save. Face-off coming up, and Cheryl, a critical one at that for both sides here. Well, you know that the goaltender is extremely fatigued. I mean, just look at the last shift. I mean, in their own zone, finding ways to get the puck out, and, of course, the opponent just owning play, hemming them in, and finding ways to get the puck to the net. So they got to continue that pressure. And if you're on the goaltender's side, you got to make sure you get it out of the zone and give them some rest. And they'll get it out of the defensive end. The Leafs gain control of the puck. Toronto's got the puck in the defensive end. Oh, and it stays out. He got a piece of that one. Domi's ready to take the draw here on this power play. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Takes it into the slot, and that's blocked in traffic. The Leafs gain possession along the wall. Here's a race for the loose puck. From their own end, trying to kickstart this power play. Here's a short pass to Bertuzzi. Puts it on net with the stop. Covers it up, we'll get a stoppage in play. Paling's gliding in for the face-off as this penalty kill will continue. They take possession as he locks him up off the faceoff. Takes the feed. Philadelphia's got a hold of it against the wall. An attempt to clear the puck from deep inside his own end. This power play only has time for one more rush. They'll have to play with urgency and not just skate the puck, but move it fast. Nylander's feeling that, and someone's going to the box. Sends a pass over. There's the whistle. Let's get the official decision. This is a frustrating situation, James. Just taking a whack load of penalties and really unable to get any momentum in this game because they're shorthanded the whole time. Toronto's got a five on three, but not a lot of time to work with. A short five on three here, but you still have a time to strike. Not even once, but possibly twice. You've got to get it on your stick, drive it through the net. Wicked stop by the goalie who got his glove out to knock it away. Puck move back to center, forcing them to regroup. Philadelphia's got a chance to work the transition game now, shorthanded. And they get that puck down the ice. Toronto's got the puck against the boards. They'll want to clear the zone here while they're trying to kill off this penalty. And the puck clears the zone. Great pass from off the right side. Here's a chance. Scores! The go-ahead goal on the power play. And specialty teams are critical, and this is exactly why you have the opportunity to change the momentum in the game, and you do it with an executed power play.
Oh, he burns the goaltender on that one. Picks up the rebound and buries it home. Goalie looks frustrated now. James knows that you got to redirect that puck to a safe spot. Toronto's on their way to victory if they can hold down this lead through the rest of the third. Well, it's all about game management, but they can't just sit back and hold on. Otherwise, their opponent, they will look to attack and they will take advantage. Put them back on their heels. Be in the offensive zone where they can't get an opportunity to attack you. Philadelphia's got the puck. Knocked away by Nylander. And now he moves it to Brody. Takes the feed. A spirited battle along the boards for the puck. Grabbed along the boards by Brody. Quick feed to Tavares. Denies him! He got all of it! Keeps possession on the play. Forsters into the offensive zone now on the attack. Oh, how did he keep it out? What a blocker stop by Sensonov. Forster's pass was so difficult, James. I mean, he stumbles, so he's off balance, and he's still able to corral the puck and get it off with precision to the shooter. That leads to a great scoring chance. And he passes it up ahead to Konechny. Launches him into the boards. Toronto's got the puck. The Leafs move to the offensive zone. The Flyers gain possession in their own end. Great reach with the poke check by Riley. Feeds the puck to Matthews. Taken by Martin. Takes it to the net. Denies him. Oh, these are the saves when you know that your goaltender is dialed in, James. The ability to get to the top of the crease and be square to the shooter, that's a great save. Across the line along the left wall. Handles that one. We got a whistle as the puck's frozen. The Leafs lead it here early in the third period. They have been dominant in the offensive area. Philadelphia's won it. Now they'll go on the attack. Here's a shot. Oh, and he just got enough of that to keep it out. It always amazes me that goaltenders often make this save look easy with all of that traffic in front and screen. I mean, it is important to battle and find the sight lines. And this goaltender oh, does a great job of making it happen. Makes the move in front. Oh, he gets all that one with the pad. The Leafs move the puck in the defensive zone. And now it's grabbed by Atkinson. Takes a shot. Comes over the make ball save. Slides the puck ahead to Gregor. Gains the zone through the middle. Moves it quickly over to Domi. Denied by Erson. Robertson's been feeling it, James. He got the go-ahead goal, and now the puck's on his stick. Oh, how did he stop that? What a save by Erson! Wow, the home team is really under pressure, and the fans know it. There's a collision. Give it to Robertson. There's a hit on the play. And the defenders come away with it. And they'll skate it out of the zone. Picked up along the boards by Frost. The Leafs have played the puck from behind the net. And since it's just out of reach. Solid hit on the play, and that knocks the puck off his stick. The Flyers have it now. Moves it to Lawton. Moves the puck inside the offensive zone. Good heads-up defensive play as he extends the stick. And now he angles it across to Reeves. The Flyers have it against the wall. Tosses it on to York. Carries it into the offensive end up the middle. Bumped off the puck. Grabs control of it at the point. Let's it fly. They score! And that's back-to-back -back snipes. Well, it feels like there's a wave of a momentum, and it has certainly changed here. You can get the opportunity, but you have to execute. That's two in a row. But your coach is preaching all the time. Take away the eyes of the goaltender. What does that mean? It means you get yourself in front of that net, whether it's a double stack, a double screen, whatever you can do so that the goaltender can't find the puck. And he couldn't as he drops to that butterfly. He tries to make himself as big as possible, but he can't catch up to the puck.
Toronto's won it. Here's a short pass to Bertuzzi. Philadelphia's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Konechny swooping in on the attack. Great defensive effort with the stick. Quick pass across to Bertuzzi. And that's knocked away in the defensive end by Sanheim. A chance on the redirect. Great reflex on display tonight on his part. That's a great save, but the goaltender had to get out to the top of his crease, take away all the ice, and make himself as big as possible. Tried to make a move, and the puck hops away. Konechny, has got a lot of flash to his game, in particular with his hands and the ability to manipulate his opponent, but he gets caught on that one, and the puck dies on his stick. The Flyers looking against the half wall. <laughs> and a quick strike here puts them right back into this one. Well, the game opens up here now, James, as they're within one, and if they can continue this press, they can get the equalizer. you got to believe that they can do it right now as you feel the momentum shift. So much of the goaltending position is tracking the puck and trying to get the sight lines, James. And with only one player in front, you might lose it for a second. But if you out-battle and out-will the person in front, you're going to find it. Unfortunately, this puck, it beats them clean. Philadelphia's goal has suddenly tightened the gap here in period number three. Well, they're within one, James, and it's not enough right now. So they're going to have to continue to counter, transition quickly, but most importantly, retrieve the puck. That is critical to be able to possess it. Long reach breaks up the momentum. Scooped up along the wall by Marner. Takes a shot, and that's broken up. Quick pass to Marner. He are really buzzing here in the offensive end. And he's going to slow things down and hang on for the whistle, and the fans on their feet. Oh, yeah, as he covers up, everyone knows the save that he just made and the opportunity he presented for his team, and everyone giving a standing ovation. The Leafs have looked good tonight, especially offensively here in this third period. Palings won the draw here in the defensive zone. Down the right wing and into the offensive zone. We got a whistle offside the call. Both centers ready to take the draw here coming up. The Leafs win it. Puck grabbed by Riley. The Leafs take it along the wall. Shot. Big time stop. Slides the puck over to Paling. Through the neutral zone up along the wing. Puck picked up by Paling. Toronto's got control of it now from their own end. Poked away at center by Drysdale. Quick shot. And he's got that one. is there the Flyers come up with the defensive zone draw Zips it on net and that goes off the glove and it stays out stops it again picked up along the wall by Tony and attendees gonna hang on here and a reset much needed one at that oh yeah i mean they have just been taking control of in their own zone james and they needed this reset they needed the goaltender to pounce on that puck they can all collect themselves and get a line change taken along the wall by riley here's a shot and it's stopped by the glove nice play there And they win the face-off and set up to go on the attack. Strong use of the body to force the puck loose. Across the line from center. Toronto's got possession of the puck. Great reach with the stick by Lawton. Up along the wall on the right side and into the attacking area. Just a little too much contact and couldn't hang on to the puck. Knocked away with the stick by Brody. Toronto's in now. Takes the pass. The Leafs played along the wing. 
Philadelphia's got the puck along the boards. Now he takes it over the line. Hathaway's got it along the wing. Beautiful read in the defensive end by Riley. Handles the puck. Quick feed to Tavares. Scores! And daggers from the goaltender as that goes off someone in front. been total non-stop action on the offensive end and they continue to lead in the third Philadelphia's won the draw in the neutral zone puck scooped up by Walker moves it quickly over to Faraby glove save made by Sam Sodoff Officials are set. Players seem ready. We're ready to get this thing back underway. Toronto's won the faceoff deep in their own end. Now over to Bertuzzi. They put the puck into the offensive end. Philadelphia's got the puck along the wall. The Flyers will play it in their own end. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Can't complete the pass as it goes off a stick. The Leafs will play it through the neutral zone. Moves the puck. And that's off the club and will play on! I love the shiftiness to his game. He reads the pace of play and he can manipulate his own speed. It's not always 100 miles an hour, but it gets the job done. And this time, he gets the shot off, but the goaltender just makes a nice save. No room for that one to get through. Toronto's through center and now in the offensive end. The Flyers scoop it up along the boards and tries to make a diagonal pass to tip it. Skates to the crease. Slides the puck over. Toronto's looking to break out. With some open space at center. Fires it. And the puck dies with the trapper save. Toronto's been going in one direction all night long, and that's to the net, and they lead it in this third. The Leafs win the draw. Now let's see what they can do with it. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. And a big stick save by the goaltender. And they'll cover it up, forcing a stoppage in play. Moments away from the faceoff. Let's get back to the action. Nice job tying up his opponent. The Leafs gain possession of the puck here in the offensive end. Great poke check on the reach. Philadelphia's gained possession along the boards. Grabbed along the board by Drysdale. The Flyers take it along the wing. Moves it to Frost. And skilled use of the stick to poke the puck away. And now it's over to Marner. Moves it to the middle. And that's stopped. Picked up along the boards by Marner. Takes a bank in front. My goodness, he kept that one out too. And this is a dialed-in goaltender. Very aware. Knows where the shooter is and in that low slot. And makes the save. The Flyers gain possession. Moves the puck to the attacking area. Here's a short pass to Gregor. He carries the puck up along the wing. Reaches out and uses the stick. Denies the shooter on that play. Moves it to York. And now he tries to get it across to Paling. Takes the shot. Makes the save, but barely with that one. Goaltender spends so much time doing tracking exercises, and it's utilized right here as he knows where this puck is coming from, and he makes the save. Sam Sonoff's going to give everyone a chance to breathe and hang on to the puck. 
Toronto's attempt to put more pucks on net has paid off as they lead it in the third. Philadelphia's won the draw inside the offensive zone. Now let's see what they can do with it. There's the whistle. We'll get a face-off after the goalie covers up. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Quick pass to Robertson. Sends the pass in front. And that carries off a twig in front of the net. The Flyers pick up steam and are on the attack. Shot! And that goes off a body. And he was right there to make the stop on that play. Streaking into the attacking zone from the right. Centering feed! Oh, and he comes up with a stop. With possession along the wall. Oh, stopped it! What a save on the play! And there's nothing technical about that. That is all about the scores! And make it a one goal game with that tally. And you can feel it coming, James. They've been playing way more aggressive. Their opponent sticks are getting tight, and they're panicking a little bit. I'm telling you, the time is now. This next shift, they got to build on that score. They are in one now. Philadelphia's got one back here in the third, but they still need another. They're going to have to swarm the puck and find a way to retrieve it. And it's shot selection as well. Good opportunities. Get to the slot and find a way to convert. And he takes the feed. Oh, he saved it. What a stop. Now that's desperation at its finest to be able to get to that puck and sending a clear message to his team that he's behind him. He's going to be the foundation tonight. Delores across the line now and on the attack in the offensive end. Great use of the body to knock him off the puck. Slides it diagonally to Krieger. Keeps a hold of the puck after that knock. Well, this game is wild, James. End to end. Big time save. Oh, my goodness. Well, throw technique out the window. This time it's all about the competitive will to get to that puck. And as play continues, this place is still buzzing and they're getting loud here now. Wow, this is all about fan appreciation for that huge save. And man, does this ever feel good. You know, you feel it right through you when you know you've made that big save. And everyone around you is appreciative. Toronto's been on a roll all night long and they continue to lead in the third. Off the draw, they take possession. Quick feed to Bertuzzi. Jack along the boards. Sends it out in front. And that's blocked in front. Battling for it along the boards. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. And that's turned aside by Ayrson. Sometimes goaltenders just make it look easy, James. And look at how big he makes himself in the net as he's trying to track and find the puck at all costs. It almost looks easy for him, but that's an impressive save. Here they come on the attack. And they continue to apply pressure here. Moves it quickly over to Benoit. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Denies that opportunity. A big face off here inside the offensive end. And from off the wing, he comes up with it with both centers scrummed up. Right through center and into the offensive zone. Fires it on net. Gets in front of it. Puck is frozen and will get a face off. A lot on the line here in this offensive zone face off. Off the draw and a nice job locking up his opponent. Both sides mixed up for that battle for the puck along the wall. The Leafs grab possession to the puck. Drysdale's been a workhorse tonight, James, and there's just another example of it, and the entire bench knows that they're invigorated by it. I mean, he's on his way down, he's stumbling, and he manages to find the puck and get a shot on net. That's tenacity at its best. The Flyers gain the zone. Shot! 
intangible effort that you can't teach, James. That's all about desperation and the will to stop that puck. Right up the gut into the attacking zone. The Flyers get a hold of the puck in their own end. Tries to feed it over to Tippett. Gaining momentum up along the side. Samsonov's a competitor, and he is not afraid to compete for every single putt and outwill and outbattle his opponent. And that highlight reel save, it is something, James, because just when you think it's almost in, he finds a way to get to that puck. Such an athletic goaltender. Moves it to tip it. There's a shot. Oh, what a stop on the play. Konechny's got control of the puck in the corner. Gains control of the puck here at the line. Quick pass to Bertuzzi. Toronto's got a hold of the puck. Here's a shot, and he makes the save. In front, and a stoppage on the play as the goaltender covers things up. Let's get our third member of the broadcast team back in here, our own Carlin Bade. What you got going on? Konechny's played a great game, and I really like his finishing touch, guys. So based on that, I'm giving him the edge in our matchup tonight. Farabee's moving it ahead. Here's a short pass to Konechny. Feeds the puck to Robertson. The Leafs are in transition. There's the whistle as the puck goes up and over the glass. The Leafs are looking to protect the lead here late in this third period as they have been the dominant offensive club. Domi's won the draw at center. Handles the pass. Turns it aside with the glove. Puck is frozen, and we get a stoppage in play. A big draw looming here in the offensive zone. Domi's won the draw here, and they'll go on the attack. Big time shot block there. Philadelphia's got the puck against the boards. Quick feed to Cates. Here in the corner, he grabs the puck. Way too much congestion blocks that. Jostling for the puck, and it's knocked away. And he takes the dish. And now it's to Domi. Little Prince gaining momentum. Slides it across to Giordano. Domi's got it in the defensive end. Receives the pass. Robertson's got it from behind his own net. Feeds the puck over to Lilgren. Domi's stick handling in his own zone. Scooped up along the wall by Lilgren. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Puts it on net. Oh, and he makes the save. I thought he was beaten on that one-timer, but no. This is a face-off. They'll definitely want to win here inside the offensive zone. Oh, and he takes possession of the puck from off. The Scores! Well, that's number two, Pounder. Yeah, he's been all over the puck tonight. He's feeling it. He's confident. You got to believe he's going to be looking for the hattie. Well, he's in tight to the net, James, and he knows that he's not going to have much time or space to get it off, so he elects to use the snapshot and beats the goaltender. Toronto's coaches have to be impressed from what they're seeing from their players tonight. All sorts of scoring chances, and they lead late in the third. Matthews wins the draw at center. Good use of the body on the play. And kept that one out of the net. We'll get a face off after the puck stays covered up. A critical draw here. Here's a change. Offense is on face off and he wins the draw. Looking to set up offensively. And now it's grabbed by Riley. Passes it over to Matthews. Oh, smart heads up play to put that one away. 
And the puck's knocked loose. And a heads-up kick pass over to his teammate. Philadelphia's regained possession of the puck. The Flyers played along the boards. Quick shot! Oh, he got all of that! What a save by Samsonov! Well, that shot came quick, and it was right out front. He had to be sharp. He had to be right on it and show his brilliant reflexes. From off the wall and onto a stick. Moves it quickly over to Matthews. Taken here by Martin. Oh, what a great save by Ayrson! A player should never be left alone in the slot, but man, is the goaltender to task here. Gets out in front of it and makes the save. Teams are ready for the draw. The line's been about to drop the puck. Toronto's got the puck inside the offensive zone. Oh, how did he get a glove on that? What a stop by Ayrson! The Leafs take possession here inside the offensive zone. Goaltender covers it up. We get a whistle to slow things down. Toronto's not far from the finish line here as they lead it late in this third. The Leafs win the draw and they go on the attack here in the offensive zone. Nowhere for that shot to go through. What a block as he lays out and I'm sure he'll feel that one. Let's it fly. Denied by the goaltender. In front of the net, the goaltender covers up for a whistle on the play. Toronto's got it in the offensive zone. Oh, and he lays out to block that, and that'll learn some respect amongst his peers. Toronto's got it along the wall. With the steal. And there's a shot. Oh, what a save on the play. Wow. Oh, that's Grand Larceny, James. I mean, he just stole one away from his opponent. What a save. The goaltender, they have to have talent. They have to have mobility. They have to be able to track the puck. But they have to have a willingness to find it and fight for any second shot. And that's exactly what happens here. Out battling, out willing, and you make the save. Teams are lined up, and we are ready to take this draw. Philadelphia's got possession here on their own end. Moves it to Sanheim. Carries the puck through the neutral zone. Approaching the puck. Oh, what a save! Uh, that doesn't swing momentum in your favor. I don't know what will. They score! Yeah, and this one will all but seal the deal, James. A real insurance marker and a game well fought and a win well earned. Well, that's a strong effort all the way around. Stingy defensively at the end of the game, and they're able to get that empty netter, and it's a dying minutes here, James. It should seal the deal. The Leafs are just minutes away from closing out this blowout. They have had plenty of scoring opportunities and have maximized most of them. Brody's taking it from his own end. Trying to get back on the attack now. Riley's been tripped up, and we got a penalty coming up here. Looks to start the transition game behind the net. Quick pass to Bertuzzi. And now he moves it to Nylander. The goal to... Oh, he made the save! How did he stop it? I have no idea, James. I mean, he was down and out, but profound athleticism and desperation got him back in to make it. They got to put a pin in the penalty balloon here, James. The frustrating calls, no question about it. But they got to figure out a way to control their emotion and get back in this game. going on the attack as they gain the zone. The lane was plugged up and that shot's blocked. Toronto's got the puck in the defensive end. Quick feed to Domi. Scores! 
Rodgers. And they strike once again with the extra attacker. Wow, this has been a potent power play. And two things you need. You need creativity, but you also need structure. And the players know exactly where they need to be to set up, to work their magic around the perimeter, and then open up the lanes to attack the net. to the net and they lead it here late in this third period Couturier's quick stick lands from the puck here at center and they keep the pressure on right up Main Street and on the attack and that's deflected off someone in front The Leafs have definitely used the shoot-first mentality and look at the score here late. And that'll close the book on this one as the final horn sounds. Toronto's effort at all ends of the ice, really, really impressive here this evening. Yeah, it was a collective effort, in particular their shot total. They just peppered the tender and drove the net. They tried to get to the paint and that's something that really paid off. Hope everyone had as much fun as we did here tonight. For all of us at EA Sports, I'm James Sabalski saying peace.